Malaysia would be going for more cleaner fuel. Uh, so therefore, they would be definitely some revamp opportunities or uh, to, to reduce the sulphur or going for Euro 4 to Euro 5 actually. So therefore, definitely we look forward to a lot of opportunities where uh, their existing refineries or new refineries definitely which is coming in rapid mm -hmm. would be going for more stricter or cleaner fuels. Mm -hmm. So the, there would be requirement for high performance catalyst and new uh, new cutting edge technologies which will help them bring their uh, not only environmental emissions but also at the same time much more cleaner fuels and Haldotrops of being a more recent and development oriented company are, is very much geared towards meeting those requirements of the industry. As Malaysia is uh, quite committed, actually we, we see it uh, that they hopefully would be signing this Paris deal by end of December. Right now they are, they are working towards it, where uh, they are expected to reduce their emissions by 45% by 2030. And we expect that there would be a lot of opportunities coming in also where Malaysia would be looking forward to reduce their emissions not only from their plants, refineries and, and chemical plants but also from their automotive sectors, their power plants where they need to reduce the emissions and they would need again a lot of uh, solutions how they can do it so they and we hope uh, Petronas government would uh, need a lot of uh, new technologies which has not been in the in the market in in Malaysia before uh, and uh, definitely there would be a lot of uh, potential for new technologies there in the environmental sector as well.